building industry has a tremendous hunger for new materials. At the same time, it's responsible for 35% of all the waste created. This linear approach is the reason for massive loss of ecological and economic value. Making building products circular is a challenging task. It questions our traditional way of working. But ultimately, it will lead to better products, improved ecological value and new business opportunities. As you all know, designing and producing circular building products requires a massive systemic change. But we can make this change happen. In fact, for some companies, it is already underway. In this course, there are people who will show us how they made the transition. There are different ways to go about circularity. Designing with waste is one of them. New building products like window frames are entering the market made from secondary materials that have been harvested from the existing obsolete stock. There are even companies who take it to the more extreme. How can we design products without any waste? And how do we make sure that circular products can be used and reused indefinitely? Changes in design and primary materials affect companies' modes of operation. Companies must constantly come up with new management schemes and business models in order to support their activities. Governments and policymakers must develop new policies in order to incentivize companies to follow this transition. Combining these ideas with feasible business models is a key to success. Here at TU Delft, we are dedicated to promoting the transition to a circular economy. This course offers professionals an in-depth understanding of designing, engineering, manufacturing and marketing circular building products. Through a series of lectures, interviews and personalized assignments, we can help you navigate the complex circular economy landscape. So join us, work with us in turning your building product into a circular building product. <laughs>